video today. Um, obviously, I'm in the car with my phone set up on my little stand so that you can see a little bit of Oklahoma. Thought I'd take a page from my sweet sister from another Mista, Mary from Mary's Crochet Chit Chat, and show you guys a little bit of where I live. Um, there's also probably going to be some water pretty close to the highway because of all the flooding and the rivers and creeks and lakes and everything overflowing here in Oklahoma because we've had so much rain. As you can see, it's a beautiful sunshiny day today on Monday, uh, May 27th. However, there's still a lot of water and I think it's supposed to actually crest today, which means more flooding unfortunately for, for people here in our state. I know there are other states suffering with the same problems, so um, I'm on my way to Hobby Lobby in Owasso, which is just about 20 minutes down the road from the town where I live. I love living in a small town. Uh, we don't have a whole lot of things there, but we have the necessities, you know, groceries and things. Ooh, I don't know if you saw that little turtle, but I had to move over a little bit, so I didn't hit him. Um, and 20 minutes down the road, oh D, was that a squirrel moment? 20 minutes down the road is Owasso, Oklahoma, which is a, pretty much a suburb of Tulsa. It's just kind of, Tulsa has spread out so much, you know, over the years. But Owasso has a lot of great amenities, great restaurants. Uh, I really enjoy Owasso. And even though it's a little further in miles from me than the town where I work, it is actually faster to go to places because I just have to go down Highway 169 and everything's right off the highway. So we're coming up on a bridge over the Caney River um, and I don't guess you can really see any of the water but it is really high. Uh, yeah, th that water right there is never there. It's pretty much up to the edge of the bridge, so the bottom of the bridge, so hopefully it won't come over that. Um, anyway, not very exciting scenery, billboards, but there is some green. It's very green here. And we like green. Anyway, I will turn this off. If I have the nerve, I will video while I'm in Hobby Lobby. I've never done that before. I feel kind of self-conscious <laughs> videoing in public where people can hear me talking to myself. But I suppose there are people who talk to themselves who aren't making a video for YouTube. So who knows? Anyway, um, I will see if I can't video that more. I don't know. I may just put this on the end of my yarn dyeing video since it's all on my phone. I normally video on my iPad when I'm doing my podcast or whatever you want to call them, my little weekly videos. Uh, but this one I'm doing on my phone so I may just slap it on the end of my yarn dyeing video that I made because that's also on my phone. And yes, I'm sure I can import them to my iPad and work on them that way. But yeah, I'm Probably not. I'm gonna figure out how to do that today. So anyway, bye. Okay, I'm sitting here at my Hobby Lobby. It's 8:58, so they're not quite open yet. Um, I was gonna stop and get something for breakfast, but the place I wanted to stop isn't open early this morning because it's Memorial Day. Anyway, I am not the only person. There are several cars sitting here waiting to go into Hobby Lobby. So. It's not just me. Anyway, uh, we'll see if I film when I get in there, if I'm brave enough. <laughs> Bye. Okay. Here I am. Again, people are going to look at me like I'm crazy.
here we are in the yarn department. Actually, this is the needle stuff, but I always take this little shortcut. So, I came to get needle tip covers. And those are jumbo point protectors. So I don't know that I need jumbos. And those have two sizes. So I'll probably just use my 40% coupon to get those. But that's exactly what I need. So, should take care of both. And here's their little clearance section. check out the yarn. I don't see any clearance stickers yet, so I'm going to say that probably my Hobby Lobby is not clearancing any yarn. Um, and there's people on the next aisle, so I may not talk while I'm doing this. I may just walk around. was a bust. Talk to you later. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, yarn clearance at Hobby Lobby. There wasn't any at mine, but I did get this Yarnology Sheep thing that shows you how big your needle markers are. I have one of these at home, not this particular one, but um, I'll be using that for a giveaway. And I got my needle point protectors. I used my 40% off coupon. That was the only thing I bought that wasn't clearance or sale. The head charms, 50% off. So I got a US one. Um, got some rings for making stitch markers. Found this really cute balloon now on one on clearance. I got one of Africa for a friend to make her a stitch marker. I'm sure she knows who she is. <laughs> this one says, follow your arrow. I thought that was really cute. So I'll make a stitch marker out of that. And then I found these a really adorable little clown charms that the person who's getting those knows who they are also because they've got a kid who doesn't, a grown kid who doesn't like clowns and I think it's hilarious. And then I got an Oklahoma charm so I can send somebody the shape of my state. And then they had these beautiful brooches on clearance. So I got this blue butterfly. I think I actually got two of those. I don't know if anybody likes seahorses, but I thought that was really pretty. So I got that one. Oh my goodness. I know who I'm sending this one to. Hi! Another blue butterfly. I have a couple of people that are butterfly lovers. And then I know who I'm going to send this one to, too. This kitty cat. I thought that was so cute. Anyway, 
Um, that's all I got. Basically a bunch of clearance brooches and some charms that I found on clearance and on sale. And, you know, I went in for my needle points, which is what I got. So that's good. Sorry about the wrestle. So I got that taken care of and that's all good. Um, I was disappointed that there wasn't any yarn on clearance, but again, I guess they don't do it across the country, the same clearance. So I'm thinking at some point they're going to clearance their yarn out. I just have to keep checking back, right? Mm, too bad I have to keep making trips to Hobby Lobby. <laughs> anyway, you guys have a great day. I'm going to uh, enjoy my Starbucks that I bought myself this morning. Um, and go home and hopefully get some stuff done around the house that I need to get done instead of just sitting there crocheting or knitting. Even those are those are productive things to do. Uh, I do need to do some housekeeping. I know, not fun. Anyway, you guys have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye.